in this video, we are going to talk about the settings of Chutu Box. To open the settings window, click the file menu and select setting. Then you will see a window with a list of setting options appears. What are these options for and how you can use them? Next, we'll give you a detailed explanation for all of them. Calculate the volume when slicing. If you turn on this option, when you slice a model, the software will calculate the volume of that model and try to repair it. The software will also display the volume and weight of this model. After the slicing is complete, the whole slicing process will get slower. If you turn this option off, the software won't do any calculation and repair, and it won't display volumes and weights, but it will slice faster. Graphics Card Backwards Compatibility Mode this option helps the software run better on some computer with old graphics adapters. Also, if you see some display or rendering issues or incorrect support adding positions, you can try enabling this option to see if this fixes those issues. Enable thumbnail preview of desktop model. This option helps you preview model files on your computer desktop or file explorer. If you turn it on, the icon of the files we show the thumbnail preview of your models. If you close it, it will only show the Chitubox logo. In the support mode, the selected model is automatically placed in the center of the perspective. When this option is enabled, when you go to support settings, the selected model will be moved to the center of the active window. If there are more than one models, the selected model will be moved to the center. If you don't want the model to be automatically moved, just turn this option off. Preview support. Shutterbox gives you live preview when you are manually adding supports. This option allows you to turn the preview on and off. If you don't want to show the support preview, just disable it and next time you won't see any preview when you manually add a support. Display support auxiliary line. When editing supports, you will see some short lines on the bottom surfaces and overhangs of a model, indicating the possible support adding positions. This option enables you to show or hide these short lines. Open graphic tool tip. When this option is enabled, if you move your mouse pointer over a button or a setting, it will show a graphic tool tip containing an instruction and usage for this item. If you turn it off, these two tips will be hidden. Grid spacing and width. Grid spacing refers to the distances between the squares on the grid platform, which is also the width of these gray lines. When this value is higher, these lines are wider. Grid width refers to the width of the squares themselves. If this value is higher, the squares are larger. Sliced file thumbnail view. This option determines how the thumbnail previews of your sliced files look like. If you choose the placement view, the thumbnail preview will show how your model was placed and oriented when you click the slice button. If you choose the home view, it will show how your slice model will look like if you click home button. For the front view, it will show the placement and orientation if the front plane of the view cube is clicked. Support Hidden Angle When editing supports, if you rotate a model up to reach a certain degree of angle, the software will hide the support structure. This setting allows you to change at what angle you want the support to disappear. Here the angle means the one between your line of vision and the line vertical to the grid platform. If this value is set larger, the support structure will disappear faster. If you set it to zero, it will never disappear. Auto save. Chutubox has an auto save feature to help you save your edits automatically. You can adjust the auto save time interval and location. The time interval settings use minute as its unit, and you can set it as low as one minute. If you are relatively more likely to experience a crashing issue, you can set it to a lower number to make sure you won't lose data. The directory settings helps you choose a location you want to save your autosave files instead of the default location.